Welcome back. Let's get an insight on Philip Larkin. Larkin was born at Canterbury and was educated at a local grammar school of his hometown and later at St John's College, Oxford. At Hull's University, he was a librarian for so many years. He has contributed to the Daily Telegraph as its jazz critic from 1961 to 1971. His honors include the Queen's Gold Medal for Poetry. He was offered the position of Poet Laureate in 1984, but he declined it. And he was influenced by the writings of William Butler Eads and Thomas Hardy. His reputation as a poet lies mainly on four of his anthologies that were published at long intervals. They are The North Ship, The Less Deceived, The Wits and Weddings, and High Windows. The Less Deceived made his name, The Wits and Weddings made him famous, and High Windows turned him into a national monument. Larkin has also written novels namely Jill and A Girl in Winter. Larkin is associated with a group of poets constituting movement in the 1950s. Larkin is the most prominent member and his poetry was the centerpiece of the movement anthology New Lines that was published in 1956. Movement poetry constitutes the poems of the movement poets and it's a reaction against neo romanticism and surrealistic abstraction of poets like Dylan Thomas. The poetry also opposed to the politically oriented poetry of the Auden group. The movement poets wanted poetry to make sense and the poet to aim at clarity and verbal precision. They observed the world clinically and cool-headedly without being emotionally overexcited. The influence of existentialism had been fairly pronounced on them. The other prominent women poets are Tom Gunn, John Wayne, Donald Davy, Kingsley Amis, and Elizabeth Jennings. Thank you for watching.